What's up everybody, The Wanderer here, and welcome back to another video. This video is going to be about a Fallout 4 mod that has just went on to the Nexus. Now before I get into it, this mod is called the Sierra 117, it's a remake of Halo 5's armor, uh, Halo, Combat Evolve, Combat Anniversary, Combat Evolve's armor, and it's a scratch made high quality Mark V armor remake that is brought into the Commonwealth. Now this custom armor made is uh, custom armor is made by Vince five seven five four, but posted on the Nexus by uh, someone named Darkman. So thank you, Darkman, for putting it up, and thank you, Vin, for everything else. Uh, Darkman did do the rigging, mesh editing, CK work, and testing. Vince did the original mesh and text textures, and so on and so forth. So there's two col There's a few things I want to get into, but first off. I want to know, guys, if you like this type of content. If you don't like this type of content, no. If you don't want me to do Fallout 4 mods, which is my name base, honestly. My name is for Fallout 4. That's why my name is The Wanderer, and The Wanderer is a song. Inside the the, sh the thing, and you also named The Wanderer too, basically. And it's, it goes so on and so forth, even though you're the sole survivor. Anyway, so yeah, um, I just want to know if you guys do like this content. Let's get this video to 15 likes. I know it's kind of high, but 15 likes likes will give me the, the give me the okay that you guys will like to see this content out of my channel so please go right ahead smash that like button if you enjoy this video and subscribe for more content and let's get right into it so as i said this vi this armor is a custom made armor by Vince now he also did two more a elite armor and a plasma rifle armor which if they if they work in Fallout 4 I'll be glad to make a video on now this armor comes in two color swaps I'm pretty sure the, the combat evolved green and the halo 5 olive green so we're gonna go to the armor station go check that out now okay come on Kim man <laughs> you can find this armor outside vault 111 in a crate in front of the guard post where the button to load the elevator is so let's go to the armor and all right so we could do an ultra light build okay greatly reduced weight okay um improved okay legs okay prevents falling damage that's cool stabilizers scoped aiming is more steady okay paint scheme okay so we have this one which we're going to look at now the that first one is the armor that I'm wearing now. Okay, so never mind. We're gonna go to the other one now. Oh, now it's a legendary. Ooh, lit. Now we're gonna go to this one, the olive green. Oh wow, the olive green actually does look like. Okay, why is it like? Why is hey? Why is this game always doing this to me? It always does like some type of weird just breaking down on me and just destroy. So now I gotta leave my settlement. And just to look at the armor set. <laughs> anyway, so here's the armor now in the olive. The olive, I don't like the olive as much as the other one. The olive looks more post-apocalyptic though. Like something that you find in like a really rare, like, you, this is like the the stealth armor, the Chinese stealth armor that you'd find. Like it's pristine, but it's for the wasteland. Like the olive I think is for the wasteland and the uh, the other one isn't really, but I like the other one a little better because of the color and my legs twitching. Oh, I don't know what to do. Ah. <laughs> so if you guys want to download this mod, the link for it will be in the description. You have to go on the Nexus mod, on Nexus mods and get the weapon there. But I'm going to change this armor back because I like the original one way better than this one. So, oh wait, recon sensors, okay. Targeting, I don't like targeting, kind of. Paint scheme, I want this one. Alright, so then once you do that, that doesn't become legendary, that's annoying. Anyway, <laughs> I have the M16 now, we're going to look at it when I have a gun in my hand now. So, let's see the running animation when I get out of here because, God forbid, the red rocket does anything but destroy my game. All right, so here we go. All right, so here's the here's the gun when you're running. It looks really good, and of course, Mr. Cut Mr. Cuddlesworth, what are you doing? So here you go. As you're running, the running animation looks perfectly fine. Everything looks fine. The looking animation's fine. Shooting's fine. No no clipping issues. Besides, I think when you're holding the gun, your hand goes through just a little bit. I know people are a little iffy about that, but it's fine. It's not a big deal. And the crouching animation, perfect. Oh, I like the extendedness of how they have the knee pads. Look. Oh, wow, I like that. And, of course, I get into the sanctuary. I'm so done. 
anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video it's a quick gonna be quick little mod videos here and there whatever but if you guys do enjoy please smack that like button let's try to get to 15 likes if you if we break 15 likes just on this video alone i will continue doing modded weapon videos along with top fives of my favorite mods of top five armor mods top five weapon mods and so on and so forth but i'm still going to be doing borderland i'm still going to do h1 pubg destiny 2 all the games that are coming i'm going to be doing videos on them so please don't worry about that i just want to i just wanted to get the fallout 4 and i'm hoping that you guys all come with me on the journey and allow myself allow me to still post up fallout 4 and any news that comes out along with borderlands 3 and all that so yeah guys thank you guys so much for watching let's break 15 likes subscribe for more content yeah i'm out that's it peace guys